Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Niagara versus Ryder college basketball matchup on Sunday, January 23rd, 2022. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. Of course, I try and win every single pick I give out. We all know that's not possible, but if you're looking for the games I like the best, the ones I'm most confident, or if you're looking for best bets from some of the top handicappers in the world, head on over to our website. It's PickDogs.com. Just click on the Premium Picks tab. But let's get to this one with Niagara taking on Ryder and well we look at this Ryder has had a rough go of it this season 5 and 12 on the season 4 11 and 1 on the season but uh, they're getting a ton of points here so we got to figure out if there's a way that we can get Ryder home with this bundle of points and I think the first thing that I always look at when I'm you know looking at games is the defense and Ryder's defense allowing over 71 points per game while Niagara allowing just south of 66 and then offensively Ryder scoring about 66 and a half points a game while Niagara um, averaging about 68.4. The issue that we have here is that Ryder's shooting percentages are horrific, both from beyond the arc and from just from the from the floor in general, ranking in the bottom, you know, quarter or bottom, you know, even further down in the 300s in uh, college basketball this season. Meanwhile, Niagara can jack up the three at the tune to 36%. So certainly an issue here for Ryder uh, as uh, they they don't have any answers for that when it comes to defending the three and defending shots on the floor. Like I said, Niagara with the clear edge in that category as well. You know, Ryder has just been absolutely terrible coming in. They did cover last time out against Canisius. They fought the good fight. We actually took them in that game, getting the four points. But Niagara, I'm not sure how they were favored over St. Peter's last game. Didn't make a lot of sense to me. But their last two losses, St. Peter's and Iona, really not a lot of shame in either of those. Niagara. 7-2 and two against the number following a straight up loss, while Ryder is 1-4-1 uh, one one against the number following a loss. The home team's covered in four of the last five. The favorite, eight of the last 11. I think all those hold true. I'm going to take Niagara here, lay the bundle, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, if you like our YouTube, be sure to check out our premium YouTube. Just click the Join Now button located directly below this video. Our premium and VIP levels, the best value in sports handicapping anywhere.